Welcome to Ballistic High Speed, where we combine two of the greatest things on planet Earth. Super slow motion. And firearms and firearm physics. I'm Adam. I'm Bryce. Join us on our journey for Ballistic High Speed. Welcome back to another wonderful episode of Ballistic High Speed. Today we've got a very interesting topic for you. We were sent this vest by Safe Vest. It is a soft body armor. This is rated to 3A, which means it should be able to stop up to a 44. So we're gonna put it to the test today. We're gonna start out with a 22, and then we're gonna go through some nine mil, and then we're just gonna keep climbing until we hit the good old fashioned Remington 870 12 gauge yeah. slug. And because spooky season is well on the way, this is what we're gonna be wrapping the body armor around. He's not gonna be wearing it for the video, but the skin should be able to tell us exactly what's happening and how well this is stopping the bullets. Then, like he said, eventually we're just gonna send a 12 gauge through it, see what happens, just for some gratuitous violence. Yeah, but I think the pumpkin's going to cease yeah. to be round. We'll see what happens. Either way, it'll be cool and it'll be in slow motion. So let's get to it. All right, this is the 22 against the safe vest with a pumpkin. Let's see what happens. Whenever you're ready, count it down. Three, two. Okay, let's check it out. Ooh, nice ripple. Yeah. That's clean. That was right in focus too. Good job on aim. Excellent job, that was great. Alrighty, let's check this out. Well, it definitely didn't go all the way through. So that's good. That is very good. Here's the entrance hole. There's one strap. Through both straps. Not surprising. How hey, do you feel on the other side? I don't feel anything. Awesome. That absolutely is what should happen. Yep. What do you feel in there? Nothing. Nothing? Nope. Yeah. Clean pumpkin. All right, let's move on to nine millimeter. All righty, this is nine millimeter versus the safe vest. This is exactly what it's rated for. We'll see what happens. Go for it. Three, two. Ooh, that was a little high. All right, this is nine millimeter, take two, to get the shot a little bit better in frame for the high-speed camera. Three, two, one. Whoa. That ripple is always so cool. I know it. Right. The round is gone before that even comes in. God, look at that caving in like that. That's all going in your, into your sternum. That's gonna hurt like hell. Yeah. Alrighty, so there's our two holes for nine millimeter. A little bit bigger holes, but let's see what the damage is. 22 for reference. Yeah. What do you feel? I can feel bulge. Yeah. It's definitely not through. There was a little bit of pumpkin juice there, so he's, ooh, he's, uh, he's mushy there. Yeah, so it, it's basically like, you know, it got punched. Yeah, like if I was to take my knuckle and. Yeah, but no bullet entrance. No. And it's just barely cracked. Cool. Well, let's throw a 45 at it, see how it handles it. All right, this is 45 ACP versus safe vest. This should be just within what it's able to maintain, but it is more energy than a nine millimeter. So we'll see how it handles it whenever you're ready. Okay. In three, two. Awesome, really good aim. Cleared. Oh, that pumpkin. Ooh, oh, man. Oh, boy. Look at that bug coming into frame. Oh, gosh. Way it bad. almost started undoing the Velcro. I know. Actually, it may have. Having the letters on there really helps you realize how much that's contorting. Yeah. Alrighty, let's check out this 45 ACP carnage. Yeah. So for reference, here's 22, both the nine mils, and then the 45. I mean, that is a much cleaner hole. Yeah. Only a bulge. Oh man. Wow. That fared really well. I was expecting a, a much bigger punch. Well, it's no wonder that ripple's so big. It's spreading the energy out really well. Yeah. And that's the one thing with the 45. It's a much fatter round. Well, we, we proved that it can contain any of those bullets. Yep. I'm sure we could send rifle rounds through it if we wanted to, but I say we just go for a 12 gauge. So if we give it a fresh side, Let's see what happens. All right, for our final shot, we're gonna be doing a 12 gauge slug against the vest. We don't really know what's gonna happen, but you ready? Yep. All right. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. 
Oh, you can see it crack right there. So he's... Let's check this out. He's laid down. Yeah, he fell. That's probably not a great sign for him. Oh, it's already cracked. Let's see the hole. Oh, oh, yeah, he broke apart. Boy. Did it stop it? Let's just rip it apart. Oh, man. Oh, no. Yeah, just pull the vest off. Okay, real quick. Come look. What do you see? That <gasps> is it. It stopped it. Stopping the round. You, you gotta be kidding. Just like the 45, it's going over a, That's nuts. a wide... Oh, that's so cool. Look at that. It stopped it, yeah. I did not expect that. I th thought for sure it would just plow right through it. So it, it punched a hole yeah, so and probably the blew the wall to the other side. Nice, that's what we want to see. Peel the top off, let's look inside. Oh man. I mean, that's how you make a, yeah. I mean, I feel like that's like 100% stopping your heart and giving you internal Yeah, weight. that's gonna like, break your ribs, your sternum. I feel like you're still done. Yeah, but the fact that it caught it, that's so cool. That's amazing. All right, this is a 12 gauge slug versus a naked pumpkin, just because we can. Fire when ready. Three, two. Oh, that was high. I think you just shot the top off. I think I did. All right, this is 12 gauge versus pumpkin, take two. All right, you may fire when ready. Three, two. Oh. Is it because I took the top off already? There's just nothing in the middle to carry energy anywhere. Whereas at the top, you were going through material the whole time. Yeah. Well, that's a wrap on this shoot. Thanks so much to Safe Vest for sending this out. Uh, I was pretty impressed. That did a damn good job. I was too. That is quite the carnage and we never did make it through. Yeah, So we sent three handgun bullets through it. We got pretty close to its threshold or so we thought, and then it caught a 12 gauge slug. So I think, Entirely, yeah. I think the only thing else it would do if we were doing rifle rounds, because those are much thinner, that would probably yes. get through. Rifle rounds would have the speed that everything today was lacking to get through. Speed is what beats armor. True. But for a 3A vest, I would say that was... Not bad. That was totally functional. Cool, yeah. Well, Safe Vest, if you want to send anything out, we will very gladly test it, or any other companies out there send some products, we'll test it out. And of course, it's going to be in ballistic high speed. So thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next episode.